Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to Farmville, North Carolina. Not the the, the Facebook game that was all the rage back in the day. <laughs> anyway, what's up, Flock? Thanks for the here. Welcome back to another Farming Sim 22 Mod Spotlight. Today we're going to be checking out the map known as Farmville, North Carolina. Um, is there really a place in North Carolina called Farmville? Because if so, that's hilarious. Uh, <laughs> For me, I remember Farmville uh, being a, a Facebook game that I used to play like way back when. I want to say like 2010, 2011. <laughs> like 10 years ago. I don't know if anyone else played that. Maybe I'm showing my age here. But this is the uh, area you start off in here. Nice little area. Nice little shop too. Forgive me, I am still sick. I'm recording this right after my Phoenix moment, so um, yeah, I'm still, I'm still, I'm still under the weather, but I, I'm recording this for you guys. But anyway, we start off here. We own like fields one and two. It looks like not for each one and two. Uh, and you start off with uh, some plots for for uh, gardening, so you can uh, so you can go in here and you can plant tomatoes, lettuce, strawberries, potato. You can plant potatoes in these things? I never knew that. Uh, with seeds and solid fertilizer. Is that add-on? I don't think that's in the base game. Someone t let me know if I'm wrong. But I don't I think the... Uh, I don't think potatoes were in the in-game greenhouses either. That might be a uh, modded feature. If so, that's cool. I like that. Traffic just came to a stand. What in the world? My computer must be lagging. Jesus, P. I thought it was just the server. Let me get down this way. These are decent sized fields. They're not like extremely huge. Sorry about the voice crack. Again. Not feeling the greatest. What is this back in here? This is just like a forestry area to cut down some trees, maybe. It's kind of cool. All right. A lot of woods on this map, especially goodness. Look at 47, 48, and 53. That is a lot of trees. This thing has got no give and go whatsoever. Yeah, we're gonna turn right check out what's down that road and then we're gonna go straight across oh wait that wasn't the right so I'm guessing that has something to do with the railroad okay I'm just about to go back up here I'm not gonna go to the right here because it, it just feels that way it looks like looks like where we really want to go is uh Left. All right, screw it. We'll go to the right real quick and see what's down here. Do, do. Just some houses, it looks like. All right, this is supposed to be you here. I really like these fields, though. They're like big, but not huge. Hmm. That's what she said. Um, oh, again, no, she didn't say that. Anyway, we're gonna stop sign. It's over here. This is, I don't think this is part of the starting area. That's definitely a modded house, a modded garage. My shift button screwed up. Oh. Why is my shift button screwed up? Oh, well, I guess I can't run. Let me in.
In this little area, what's back in here? Oh, nice little hangout area. Netflix and chill, that's right. There we go. Must have been something in there or something. Anyway, by the way, for those of you who don't know, I, I feel like I included it here. Uh, Glenn from OK Use Mods, uh, he actually come into my stream one day when we were wandering around here, and he actually painted these. Like that is awesome. That is awesome. I I, I just I I feel like I should point that out because I I've, that that blew my mind when he told me that. I was like, wow. He's actually put his own little paintings in in the game. That's pretty awesome. That's good dude. Good dude. I I have I've enjoyed his work o over the past couple games, and uh, he's always he's always stopping in the chat during um, the live stream. So he's a uh, and the more I get to the like the more he's told me about himself. Uh, the, more he's just a he's an interesting guy. I'll just put that put it that way. Very friendly. N not interesting in a bad way. Not interesting could be uh, taking as a, a negative term. But no. Anyway, let's get back to the map. <laughs> we. It's down here. I guess we'll take this here. Farmville, North Carolina. Welcome, y'all. All right, we got a ton of stuff going on down here. Looks like this is gonna be like all of our cell. Oh wait, this is the actual town. Nice. So the cell points around here. More cell points. Yeah, it seems like everything's just kind of like from the default map. I like this little, I like this downtown field though. This is cool. I like this. I like this a lot. Yeah, it's all in-game stuff, but I like the placement. Like it, it has a very small town feel to it. I like it. Giants, take note. They just took your stuff and just put it in a more, I guess, a m small town America feel. That, that was pretty good. Kudos to them. I like that. I like that a lot. I want to see what these big buildings over here n next to 43 are. I want to check those out. 27, 26 is some big fields, man. Not huge. But definitely bigger for this map. 15 and 19 are pretty big, too. I like it. I love it. I want some more of it. Right, let's see what this way is. It almost looks like chicken houses, but then again, it doesn't. There's nothing here. What in the There's nothing here. There's definitely something here on the map, but there's nothing here in actuality. It must have got removed. That kind of sucks. Bummer, dude. Alright. We're gonna make a right out of here. Hard right. Skirt. Slam into the fence.
wide open spaces, yeah. <clears throat> It looks like, uh, okay, is that sh the way you saw wool and livestock? All right, all right. <coughs> I want to go out by 31:30. See what's out there. Sorry if any of my coughs get through. I'm gonna try to get, like edit them out when I'm editing my video, but I can't make any guarantees. Keyword being try. Blink, 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 blink. Alright, so we're gonna make a right right here. Wait, what'd that say? I missed that sign. So I'll reverse, Terry, back it on up. Fountain. Fountain North Carolina is that place? Are these just tree? Okay. It's a bunch of trees. Orchard, maybe? I'm guessing it's just regular trees that you can cut down. I don't see anything special to them. Alright. So, <clears throat> I'll give the map a 5 out of 5. I actually really do like this map and the varying sizes of the fields and shapes. Like, not, no two field is the same shape. No two fields is the same size. Um, I do like how it's laid out. I will say, like, this this whole tree area thing kind of throws me for a loop. I, I guess it's supposed to be, like, an orchard or something. I mean, I guess you, what you could technically do is cut all these trees down and put, like, a, a vineyard here. That'd be cool. That'd be a cool option. I do love the small town. I do love the town in this <coughs> map because it, it very much feels like a small, t like a, a small American town. So, that... That I really, I really did like th this whole, the bottom left-hand section. That was pretty good. I like that. Um, yeah. There's not really much else to say. I'm pretty sure if if uh, I wasn't feeling the way I was feeling, I'd have a whole heck of a lot more to say about this map. But right now, I just, I, it, this map is really, really nice. I'm sorry I couldn't do it justice today, but it is definitely worth checking out if you have it, uh, haven't already. But that's going to do it for today's Mod Spotlight, guys. If you guys did enjoy today's Mod Spotlight, be sure to leave a like down below. This does help me out so very much. I do appreciate it so very, very much. If you guys do want to see future Farming Simulator 22 Mod Spotlights, be sure to click that subscribe button. If you guys want to be notified whenever I do go live or upload a video, click that notification bell. As always, guys, thank you so very, very much for watching. I'll see you guys next time. Bye.